In this chapter, we will focus on the powerful ways Studio uses and enhances photos. Photos are located in the library under the All Media category. Select Photos. Here you will see all the photos that have been imported into the library. Eventually, you may have hundreds of photos to choose from. You will want to use names that allow you to search for the exact photos you require. Let's use the search window to search for all photos with sky in the name. It quickly narrows your search. Remember, if you want to go back to viewing your entire library, close the filtering by bar at the top. This will bring you back to a non-filtered view. You can also rate your photos. Decide how many stars we will rate some of these photos. Later, you can use the Group By drop-down menu to group your photos in a variety of ways. Select By Rating. Your photos are now displayed in groups from highest to lowest ranking. If you would like to export your picture for use outside of Studio, you can now do it without the need for a project. Simply select the photo, push Export, and this will open your photo in the Avid Studio Exporter window. You can select if you would like to export it to a file, disk, or web. It is that easy. These powerful exporting functions are discussed further in the chapter called Export, Disk, File, and Web. You can also improve or make changes to your photos by double-clicking on a picture. This will open your selected photo in the Corrections window. You will see buttons that allow you to enhance, crop, straighten, or remove red eye from your image. You also have access to the Photo Navigator strip at the bottom to select other images for correction. These are your Rotate Left and Rotate Right buttons. With this button, you can show or hide the navigator. The Before After View button activates side-by-side -side views of photos before and after correction. Let's make some corrections. Crop the photo using the Crop button. Adjust the handles to cover the part of the image you want to leave. Click Preview. You can also clear crop, cancel the crop entirely, or press apply to update your photo in the library. Let's straighten this image as well. Straighten allows you to rotate your image if you want to change the horizontal plane of your photo. Simply grab and rotate the image the desired amount. Click Apply, and your image is now ready for use in the library. As shown in the Smart Movie Smart Slide chapter, you can use your newly improved photos in a creative Smart Slide or Smart Movie. Avid Studio makes organizing, improving, and correcting your photos easier and more powerful than ever. Hello, I'm Paul Holtz from Class On Demand. This introductory chapter gave you a quick look at the creative power and flexibility of Avid Studio. 
If you'd like to learn more about creating your movies with the same high-quality production polish used in the latest Hollywood blockbusters, then order your copy of Class on Demand's Complete Training for Avid Studio on Avid's website. On behalf of Avid and Class on Demand, thanks for watching.